Okay, so before I just jump right in like I usually do, um, I said to switch to controller because I thought, hey, maybe the controls are better on controller. So let's see if it is. <laughs> Get that fucking mouse out of the screen. <laughs> Sorry, it's a bit an overreaction. Not too far from here. Oh, which was switching. Okay, episode four, so we're going to Lorian. Don't them. stay out too long. Life worth living. Yeah, see, that's that explains it right away. But I'll be back before you know it. Like, what was the point? No, I want to go with Lori. Ugh. Isn't this actor like a weirdo? Like, doesn't he go on like weird? Bake it podcast, or does he have his own weird podcast? Like, you know, those weird, like, misogynistic podcasts that every man needs to have nowadays. <laughs> Isn't that a thing? Hold on. I'm not sure. John Bernfall controversy. Let's see if something comes up. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I don't want to know about this. It's weird cop stuff. Like, what? Ugh. Sorry, like, I'm, I'm finding some weird shit related to the Punisher, but not directly about the actor. Oh, right. He had, like, he was, like, on Joe Rogan with Shia LaBeouf. Ugh. That's what it was, I think. Fuck Shia LaBeouf. My god. Um, sorry, this is like so random. Well, not random, but you know what I mean? Like it's, why are the buttons in the corner still PC? Whatever. Um, he's been on fucking, yeah, like he's weird. Because why, why is he on Joe Rogan? Like girl. Let me call him a girl. Uh, sorry, I just, I really need to see if I can find whatever it is I'm thinking of because I feel like there's something I'm forgetting about him. Uh, yeah, okay, so it, I think it was this. I think it was the Shia LaBeouf thing that he had him on his show, I think. His podcast, right? It was like, um, Sarah Wayne Callis, who plays Lori, was on his podcast, I think, and um, she was like talking about misogyny and how, uh, and like feeling uncomfortable around men and stuff. And then suddenly Shia LaBeouf is on the show. Yeah, that's probably what it was. Yeah. There's, and there's more, I think, because I just, I see this one thing here. Uh, but. It, there, there's no like source, so I don't want to say it out loud, but it sounds familiar. Yeah. But whatever, he's not played by him in this, it's just his face. Sorry, that was a bit of a... I just, if I feel like I remember someone being like controversial or just plain awful, um, I have to look it up because like one, I could be entirely wrong and misremembering and I don't want to just say that. <coughs> If that's the case, and just be like, oh, isn't this guy like the worst? And then turns out, no, actually, it's like, yeah, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to, like, that sucks. I don't want to do that. Um, so I always have to like look it up to make sure. And also I just, it, although if I don't look it up, it'll just be stuck in my brain. Like, what was it that I feel like I remember? What was it? And I'll just don't not pay attention. So I have to look it up. But yeah, he's definitely weird. Okay, let's look at these controls. Um, obviously they're Xbox and I have PlayStation controller, but it's fine. I'll check later if I can like fix that somehow. Maybe you can do that while you're in the game actually. Hold on. Because uh, I know sometimes if you disable Steam input, it'll give you the right controls. Yeah, in fact, that's all you need to do. Great, okay. Um, L2 to aim. 
R2 to shoot and heavy attack and hold for second heavy attack and throw item. Right, right, right. Options to pause. Um, touchpad for skills menu. R1 for light attack combo. Okay, so R1 and R2 are the attacks. And L2 and L1 are, well, L2 is draw firearm and L1 is using items. That's fine. Up is camera center. Left is movement. Yeah, left and right, obviously. Um, triangle to interact, pick up items and execution. Circle to dodge roll. Good, 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 good. I was worried there was going to be that. Um, hmm, X to reload and hold to climb. I get the hold to climb, but I would definitely have preferred like um, triangle for reload or I don't know, maybe even like Clicking the um, oh no, clicking the right trigger is uh, is it right? What are we called? Right bumper. That's what they're called for uh, PlayStation. Um, that's for instinct and scope, and uh, the left one is for crouching. Uh, but yeah, so triangle square is uh, stab, attack, and stomp. Okay, X is yeah. I can get used to that. Okay, probably gonna take me a little bit. I'm losing some frames here. Why is the fucking Yeah, like if I, that's annoying as shit. If I use the controller, the mouse shows up in the middle of the screen. So I have to like move it down. Can't go back just yet. Need to find some food for the camp. Do I have the browser open? What, what is take, why is it so framey? Is this just what it is or is it like, no, my, it's not taking off my memory or my CPU. It's like fine. So I think it's literally just like, Game. Look, the buttons are all fucked up. It's weird. Can't go back just yet. Need to find some food for the camp. Wait, is this going back or? Ooh, these frames. Okay. Come on, let's do this. Okay, so it was light. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so it's like a light, light, heavy, light, a light, heavy, and heavy, heavy attack. <laughs> that, that'll that help me remember it. So L, uh, R1 is light, light, heavy, light, and R2 is light, heavy, heavy, heavy. <laughs> uh, okay. And then... Whoa! Jesus Christ, dude. This voice actor seems to be doing a good job so far, too. Oh, there's stuff there. I think it's like, okay, that's what that was. Then, um, how's his butt look? Sorry. It's a cute little butt. I'm glad that games are, you know, giving men butts lately. Because for such a long time, the, the status quo was to have no butt. Like, not even, like this a small butt like no butt at all like i i like there's this shot that is always in my head when i think about this which is in until dawn matt bends down bends over to um close the uh, what the fuck is it called in the in the tower the radio tower after emily and him have climbed up they close the little hatch the hatch that's what i can say um, he bends down to Close the hatch, I think lock it. And he, his body is in full view, so you can see his butt when he's bending over, and it's like, there's nothing there. There's nothing there. It's like, it caves inward. Like, I was just like, I, I was just looking at it, I'm like, huh. Like, it's, that's all, that, I, that is the first thing that comes to my brain every time <laughs> I think about this. Like, give, give him a little butt. Cause that looked ridiculous. <laughs> uh, whatever, sorry. I'm doing a lot of tangents, I don't know why. Uh, okay. What's this? Nice find. Skill points. Can't click the fucking... Oh, I have to click share instead of the touchpad, whatever. I hate that it's showing me like both PlayStation buttons and keyboard. Uh, Destiny's 
Destiny's affect skills, huh? Oh, T-Dog's there, okay. Uh, you choose, oh, there's m multiple people have unlocked now, weird. Um, uh, you chose your destiny. One of the characters left the group and you can't unlock their skills anymore. Oh, Marl, okay. Good, okay, if a character dies or leaves your group in the future, all skills already unlocked are kept, but you won't be able to unlock any locked skills on the character's tree. Okay, that makes sense. So yeah, no Merle. Okay, so we've unlocked Rick, Shane, uh, T-Dog, Merle, but he's gone. Good. Glenn, Daryl, Dale. Hold on. Dale is in the game, but not Andrea. Dale is like a supporting character to Andrea. For the most part, that's what he is. That's a, that's the role he serves. Like, especially in season one. Why? Like, I'm sorry, why would they have Dale and not Andrea? Like, if you're going to get rid of Andrea, get rid of Dale too. What is the point of Dale? I'm sorry. That is just, uh, that just annoys me even more about Andrea missing because you... You, you couldn't find a way to bring Andre into the game, but you brought Dale? I'm sorry, but that just annoys the shit out of me. Uh, but Dale, I guess. Uh, Carol, Lori, and Carl. Are we going to play as Carl? Huh. I thought he was just going to be like a supporting character since he's, he's a child, but that's cool. Okay, what do we have that we can unlock here? Um, we have nine skill points, okay. Uh, uh, each bullet can go through one enemy and hit another one behind it. Mm -hmm. I feel like that's very, like, in a crowd that can work well, but I don't know. That feels like it's going to be, it's the type of thing where, what the fuck am I trying to say? It, it, it'll it only, like, be useful in very specific situations, but you unlock more above it, so I guess, uh, yeah, 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 so that's why you should get it. Okay, fire axe, uh, enable fire axe tactical attack, hold weak attack. But what is that? But, hmm. Oh, I guess if you like hold L1, then it replaces the hold attack, I guess. Okay. You should knock walkers back down, walkers down and try stopping them. Okay, that's good. Uh, what do we got for T-Dog? Um, execution recovers plus 30 health. Ooh. Hitting enemies grants 33% more adrenaline. That's good. We got Daryl. Um, stomp costs less stamina. Crossbow clip size to three. Auto rifle damage. Did Dale even use guns? Like, wasn't he like a pacifist or something? Like, why do I not buy him having it? Maybe I'm just remembering that he actually had a rifle, an auto rifle, but I don't. Why don't I buy him? I don't buy him having one. Uh, for Carol, we have stabbing awards extra adrenaline. Lori, we got reduces stamina cost for dodging. That's like all she has. Okay. Uh, reduces broken stat status duration. Reduces all incoming damage. Decrease. Okay. Wait. Reduces all incoming damage. Decreases incoming damage. Why don't these have the same wording? That is weird. Okay, but we still have three, uh, oh, sorry, five, <laughs> five characters to unlock. Um, but I think because I'm playing a Shane right now, I'm going to get uh, the fire axe thing. That's going to be great. Still six skill points. Do I want to use them on anyone? Anything like speak to me? I like dodging, so whatever. Let's get this. Hey, this will come in handy. <laughs> kind of does sound like him a little bit. Like so far, these actors aren't doing a bad job. The ones that are replacing. Can't uh, go back just yet. We need to find some actors. food for the camp. Okay, let's go find some food and see if I can manage with a controller. So I've been doing a, a lot of yapping. <laughs> I just I just can't stop talking. Uh, I barely, how long have I been recording? 21 minutes and I'm still like right here at the start. That's kind of funny. Not
Shit. Even more skill points. Where'd all these things come from? And there's even more down there. <gasps> but okay, let's unlock something more then, because now we have no five. Does it, do any of these like really speak to me? Hold on. Stomp cost less stamina. Cross. Oh yeah, crossbow clip size probably. Yeah, that would be good. Hey, this will I, come in handy. For when I play as Daryl. Okay. Oh, that's where I came that Carl would like this place. Maybe we could catch some frogs. Frogs. Okay. But can I go down this way to get the skill points? No, that's just showing me that. Oh, <laughs> that they're there. So, like, if I want to make the little detour to get them, I should. And I'm going to because I want those skill points. Okay, find food for a group. I need to find seven food. Are we going to feed them walkers or what? How are we going to find seven foods? <clears throat> Shit. That son of a bitch is drawing every walker for miles with that racket. Who? Screams when you enter its sight. The noise attracts even dis distant enemies. Kill it or watch out for hordes. They're screaming? Oh my god. Wait, which one is that though? Oh, it's the red one, obviously, yeah. Also, why did he say that it was doing it? It wasn't even doing it. Like, it's fine right now. What are th Oh, these are butter- Oh, these are pretty! Pretty butterflies. Oh, oh. Please, 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 please. Fuck it. It's it. It's a uh, fucking- It's a- uh... Sorry. I just need to get used to the fucking buttons. Ooh, good. Good job. Oh. No! No! I don't have the strength. Only dodging, no attacking, no shooting. Okay. Oh my god. But like it's square to roll. Better now. Get off of me! Get off! Help! I can't do this anymore! Let me go! I don't Ah, you oh my god. Yeah, I really it's like starting over all starting out all over again. Because I need to better now. I need to like learn. I don't have the strength for big swings anymore. You talk too much, to be honest. Uh, I have to like teach assess me. <laughs> I have to like teach myself the combat all over again, but it's fine. It's still early. It's whatever. <laughs> oh god. I don't know why, why I decided that this part was going to be like... Oh, it's because my meds have kicked in. Okay, I get it now. <laughs> I was so confused about why I was talking to him so much. It's because my ADHD meds like kicked in just now, like a few minutes ago. Probably like right when I started this part. <clears throat> Maybe even when I ended the last part, because I started talking a lot then too. Well, whatever. Better than saying nothing. Uh... Okay, not gonna get the meat? I'm kidding. Still gotta find food for those folks. For Lori and Carl. And, what? and, I mean, the others. I could use some meds. Oh, food. Or flowers. Berries, yeah. But they're white. Doesn't that mean they're, like, poisonous? I feel like I know that that's, like, that means poisonous. Oh, they're, like, yellow, I guess. Oh, this ought to do the trick. Need more though. Yeah. There's a bunch of oh, there's a bunch of those too. Oh, okay. Oh, so it shows me that I'm hidden up there because I'm in a bush. That's good. I like that. I'm glad bushes are. Okay. Uh. Oh, there's. Can I? I'll take that. Thanks. This will distract them. Get into the bush, get into the bush, thank you. And the red ones are the really dangerous ones because they'll start screaming. 
checked every other walker to me. We got the chain. I don't remember if I like chain or not. I, I generally don't remember, but I feel like I probably um, probably agreed with him. If, I feel like if I feel like if I remember correctly, I liked Shane at first, and a lot of the time preferred like agreed with him more than Rick on some stuff. But then there was like a turning point in season two where they clearly just wanted him to be the villain, and so suddenly he was like ridiculous a little bit not to like an extreme st extremely bad written amount but you know I, I feel like i i remember feeling like a shift at some point where i didn't agree with him anymore i don't know but but i remember agreeing with him a lot more than the show wanted me to i'd have to like rewatch again i like i should probably do that soon rewatch the first few seasons again see if maybe i can get a little further that this time you turn around, buddy. I could have walked while I was talking, but I, I have a hard time, like, with that. <laughs> Multitasking in that way. Can I get away with this? Right through the skull. Yeah, I can. I sure can. No, he just... he Natural causes. Dude, you can look away. Natural causes. Um... Fuck, how am I gonna do this? Like, if you would turn around, I could probably go get that guy. So if you would just, like, turn around. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Um. This'll distract him. Right through the skull. Yeah, you to, like. That's like the most important one to get rid of because, well, those guys, because there's multiple of them. Because they're gonna like fuck me over so fast. Okay, there's just one more, no, two more of those. Um, hold on, I didn't actually look at the items and stuff. Need healing. Yeah, I don't have any healing. What do we got there? I'm gonna need to activate it again. I thought I could like deactivate it. <laughs> what are you doing? They're just dancing. <laughs> uh, oh, that's a bottle, okay. Oh my god! Oh, but I can grab them! This is like... Oh. Please, can I get a far away prompt? I got it for a second. Come on. Here we go. I appreciate them teleporting towards me. <laughs> if I get the prompt, it's nice. Instead of me moving towards them. I'll take that, thanks. Probably make a lot more sense if I move towards them with the prompt, but... I like that it works the other way. Right through the skull. Adrenaline is pumping. Ooh. Woo -hoo -hoo. That's not the sound I'm meant to make. I don't know how to make like masculine sounds. I guess. <laughs> uh, right, right, right. Oh, healing, healing. Ooh, food, 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 food. Let's go get it. Now that the. Screamer, I guess, isn't yeah. roaming over here. Oh no, that's just a crowbar. Can I grab that, or am I in danger if I do? Yeah, I am in danger if I do, but I could still do it. Oh, keep. I don't know why, but I keep mixing up off. L1 and R1 for some reason, which is silly because the L stands for left. So just click the one on the left. I haven't used a controller in a while, that's why I'm, I'm mostly just using, um... Oh, there's a bottle over here. Oh, right, because I picked it. Duh. Uh, can I, like, get you to turn around? This'll distract them. Better watch my step around these walkers. This time, stay down. Rick says that too. It says something all of them are gonna say, like, they didn't want to come up with unique, with all unique lines. Hello, Screamer. Why aren't, like, every single Screamer, like, they're into BDSM? Like, 
it's cool, whatever. I don't kink shame, but why is every single one of you into BDSM? It's a little right between the eyes. A, a weird coincidence. No, I, I'm doing stealth, so I'm not gonna do flashbangs. Maybe that can be used in stealth. I don't know. And I have an execution ready in case stuff. Stealth fails. Um, I only need two more food. I can grab that one. No, they're basically just standing still. So I can definitely grab that one. And there they are, the two ones. Two berries. And I still need to find the skill. Wait, will it automatically end if I grab that? So will it be like, okay, get out of here? Because I would like to grab the... Um, uh, the skill points. There, there's one, but that's not the one, right? Or is it? Where's the, where was I before? Oh, I was up there. It might be that actually, now that I think about it. Got it. Okay, and that's the last one. That's probably where I'm gonna have to run or something. Are they, oh, the roamer's gonna go right past here. I'm just calling, I'm just gonna call it a roamer, I guess. No, I like Screamer, but the Screamer's gonna go right- No, they're blocked. Ah, uh, okay. Jackpot. Six skill points. Ooh. Okay. Uh, base bat dev devastating attack. Hold strong attack. Oh, wait, I can do that for myself, though. Hmm. I wish there was, like, a little video you can play to, like, see what it is. <laughs> Because all this tells me is that it's a whole strong attack. But it's just like, okay, but what does it do? <laughs> Let's give T Dog an upgrade. Um, hitting enemies brings more adrenaline or. I feel like more adrenaline probably first and then this one because this is like execution recovers plus rowdy health which you need adrenaline for so let's yeah, this will come in handy oh i can get both okay perfect that's gonna be great uh, i don't know if there's anything over there because i feel like i was up there right so isn't the skill points i want over there Oh, I have it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I can scatter them, right? If I do this. This will distract them. So they're no longer. Yeah, okay, good. Because, like, as much as that, like, is great when I'm over here, if I want to go over there, it's horrible because they're all going to see me. Probably. And, yeah, like, the, the AI pathing for the enemies could definitely be improved. But as far as I can tell, they only gave this game one update and then never again, which sucks because if they kept giving it like regular updates, they could turn this game into something that, you know, the general public likes. Like, I am enjoying it, you know, despite its clunkiness. Like, it feels like I'm playing, um, like, it feels, it feels like I'm playing a really old game that, you know, is like beloved, has like a little uh, cult following or whatever, you know? That's what this game feels like, which I like that. Like, it, it feels nostalgic to play it. Not only because it's The Walking Dead, and I stopped watching it long before it stopped airing. Um, but also, I don't know, it just has that feeling for me. They're still getting stuck on each other. I'll just grab this. That's enough for now. Okay, checkpoint, that's good, okay. What's that? Do you see that? Oh no, that's the crowbar. I'm just worried about the fucking screamer. Because look, like what am I supposed to do with that, you know? Are there any bottles? All oh, right, there's a bottle over here. I can grab that. Please don't see me, please don't Got see me. Got it. Thank you. Cause I just need them to like scatter. Like maybe make sure that the screamer can get back on their path and like go over here so they can kill, kill them, you know? This'll distract them. And please let the screamer get back on their path. Please. Nope, not gonna do that. Can you all just like 
stop? <laughs> Maybe they should do an update or whatever where they can walk through each other. Like, just let them clip through each other. Who cares? As long as it fixes this. Because it's... It's not great. Or maybe like, if their pathing is interrupted by anyone that isn't the player, then after a while of their pathing being stuck, like it like has a timer or whatever, eventually they can walk through each other so that they get out of it, you know? I don't know, I just think... The fact that it's like this is a little... <laughs> it's bad. Because I, I can't even... Like, this isn't safe, you know? Like, how is that one stuck, though? That one has- that one's just walking straight into a rock. Like, that one should be fine. Like, that one's- <laughs> Whatever, I don't care, I'm going here. It's not that important. This is totally unsafe, I shouldn't do it. Um... What is that? Is that- oh, that's the exit. Oh, no, it's like a box you climb up on. Okay, okay. For the exit. Oh, I can kill this one. Oh, there's skill points over here. Okay. This time's now you move that. Okay, so sometimes he moves towards, like, that, which makes sense. And sometimes it's Jackpot. Okay. Hmm. Let's see. I wonder who the other five... Like, I know uh, one of them's Michonne, and one of them is Maggie. But who are the other three? Do I know? Like, if I look at these characters, can I tell? Because these are, like, the season one characters, right? So if I look at... Think of season two. Obviously, Maggie and Michonne. Which, again, Michonne, she was introduced... At, uh, she was started season two... Or season three. What, it was season three. With Andrea. Like... Like, how are we going to do the start of Michonne's story without Andrea, you know? Like, it's... it's really, It really sucks, because she, she is a pivotal character. Are they going to replace her with someone else? Like, is someone else going to take Andrea's role? Or... I don't know, because this, this makes me really sad. <laughs> uh, but, um... Hmm. Who are the other three? Maybe one of them is the governor. I don't know. I feel like that might be possible. Because he's on the, like, cover of the game. Maybe Beth is one? Because I know Beth's actor is back for this. So maybe they made her a playable character. Which, that I would love. I love Beth. Um, she's actually my third favorite character after Lori. <laughs> I feel like that's such an interesting set of the uh, top three characters. Like Andrea, Lori, and Beth. I don't know. I love them, so... I guess shit. Whatever. Let's get an upgrade. Um, hmm. eh, plus one from all ammo pickups. Sure, why not? That's gonna be great. <clears throat> Need this to turn around. Damn it! What? How? I was in a bush. You freak! Out of here! Whatever. How do I climb? How do I climb? Ah! Get away from me! I can't believe Rick's gone, but I did everything I could, didn't I? I'm sorry, brother. I like the acting for Shane too so far. I know, like I saw a lot of reviews. Well, not a lot, but I saw some reviews talking about, like, horrible act or bad acting, and I'm just like, hmm, so far, it's fine. I'm liking it. Uh, let's see, we got some... Uh, auto rifle damage, yeah, sure. Hey, this'll come in handy. That's cool.
The only thing that matters is Lori and Carl now. Gotta keep them safe, no matter what. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, sure. Lori, no, silly. Shane, heading back to camp now. Hurry on back, you promised Carl some frog catching. <laughs> Tell him I'm on my way. It literally looked like it was going to jump on my face, the way that angle started. Which, he can do that if he wants. I don't know. Hi, Dale. Oh, there we are. Rick? Dad! I feel like Rick Dad! looks the least Carl. like Rick. Lori. Thank God. Thought you were dead. Shane said. Oh, right. The lie. Right. I forgot about the lie. Lori, we need to talk about. No, Shane, we don't. From now on, my family is off limits to you. Oh, we're speed running. Okay. Speed running the story. I don't like that, but whatever. <laughs> Ooh, HQ, there's right. Oh, <gasps> am I gonna get to walk around and talk to people? Cause I love that. Oh my God, please. Is that what I'm gonna do? Yes. Get to know the optional. <gasps> oh, okay. Now we're getting into the meat of the game. I feel like, okay, good, good, good. Join the group. I'll join in the group. Oh, right, Sophia's right there. Oh, is Sophia also playable? Why wasn't she in the list, though? That's weird. Everyone was in the list but Sophia, but I guess she's added now? Maybe? Merle's left the group, yeah. Bye, loser. Don't look back. Eyes forward, soldier. Yeah, this actor's doing a really good impression of Andrew Lincoln, I feel like. As, uh, Rick. As Andrew Lincoln, he has an accent, so... No, she's still not here. I guess maybe Sophia isn't playable. Which, that's too bad. I feel like it would be interesting to have her be playable if she's, like, uh, running away from the walkers this season, too. Wait. Hmm. Are we going to be able to save Sophia? I hope so. Do the, um... Time to meet the new neighbors, I guess. Yeah. She's like, um... I don't know. I feel like, oh, it feels like Baldur's Gate. These have new things to say. These two have new things to say, but the others might have new things to say because it only gives you the exclamation marks when people have, to have something to say like 20% of the time. Uh, which, if you didn't know that, yeah, in Baldur's Gate 3, it, it, it is not safe, in fact, to only like talk to people when they have an exclamation mark because it only does that f like the tiniest amount of the time they have something to say. Most of the time when they have something to say, there will be nothing over their head. Sometimes a character, one character will have something over their head and another won't, but they will have an equally important thing to say, both of them. It's a, like, it's a little, I, I hope they've fixed it in an update and you know, adjust it. Make it better. Resolve conflict. Who are you conflicting with? The table? Gotta do something. I did what I could. Oh, Ooh, interesting. Oh, it's not voiced? Okay. Um Daryl and Glenn. Okay, this is interesting. Group conflicts, okay. Daryl stalks over to Glenn. So you're one of those sons of sons of bitches handcuff my brother and chain him to a roof. He snarls. <laughs> this reads like fan fiction. Okay, um, I can't do their voices though. Chill, dude, Glenn says, taking a step back. Wasn't my call, but it was the right one. Merle was a danger to us all. All right, this is like, isn't this like an actual scene in the show? Why isn't it voiced? <laughs> Daryl's eyes narrow as he reaches for his knife. By taking yourself, by defer, what do you mean? Because like, take your responsibility. Like, I'm not going to be like, I'm not gonna be like, um, yeah, that was my bad, because I don't regret it for a second. Does deferring responsibility mean I'm gonna be like, 
I agree with Glenn. Also, fuck Merle. Because that's what I want to say. <laughs> I mean, I guess to take responsibility might not be like, oh, I feel bad. It might just be like, yeah, I did that. I did that. Because, okay, I'll take responsibility, whatever. Give me a break. Give me a break. Hmm. Damn, I wish there was more to this, like, you know, actual dialogue and stuff. Can it at least type out what I say and how it resolves itself, right? Because I, I have no idea what Daryl's reaction to that was, but I got five skill points, so solved. Whatever. Guess that's fine. Wait, the button's still here. Oh, talk, okay. Wait, that's the mission table, so that's okay. Damn walkers are finding a way to camp more and more. We gotta do something. Not horrible. Well, it started off good, and then as as it kept talking, it got like worse. But it's not horrible. There, there, I can I can like hear our, like the similarities. Not like the world wasn't a shit show anyway. It's it's not bad. It's not bad. Um, I think uh, Rick and Shane are better, but and Glenn. But I don't think really think Glenn sounds like Glenn. But I I like the I like the voice. Guns are just gonna draw more walkers. We need to keep quiet. Mm. He's like 50-50, but it's not horrible, so so that's good. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, not the type of conversation I was hoping for. I was hoping for like an actual conversation when you talk to people, but... Back with your family. Well, will you look at that? Yeah, will you look at that? It should go away when he doesn't have anything more to say. Huh. Okay, hello, Carol and Sophia. Thank God her husband isn't here. Beautiful day, isn't it? I don't want to see that shithead. Hmm, sorry, I forgot to pay attention to the voice acting. <laughs> see how close it sounds to me. <laughs> Not really used to talking much. Oh, that's good. That's good. Sounds a lot like her. I can help with that laundry if you'd like. Yeah, that's not bad. I like that. Okay. I knew we'd have to cut someone loose sooner or later. Mm hmm. I knew we'd have to cut someone loose sooner or later. Can't talk to Sophia. Okay. We need to go on a run. Let's check out the map over on that table. No, I haven't talked to everyone yet. Uh, hi, T Dog. Wait, what, what was his name? It's like, was it Theodore? I think so, Theodore. Is it like Theodore Wallace, or is that some. Other person. Hold on. Theod because I don't know what that is. Theodore Wallace. Hold on. Huh, that's a character in The Evil Within. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Is that not his name? I, I think it's Theodore, but I don't know if what I got Wallace from. I might have just gotten it because of The Evil Within, because I have watched playthroughs, so I haven't played them yet, but I do have the games. <laughs> Douglas. Okay, Wallace Douglas. Yeah. Okay, Theodore Douglas. Hello, Theo. Thanks for what you did back there. I'm T-Dog, by the way. Nice to meet ya. I'm Rick. Probably short for Richard. I liked my life before this, you know. May not have seemed like much to some people, but I had everything I needed. Hmm. Oh, man. Are you just trying to destroy us like a tree stump? Can you believe this shit? Uh, not really. I don't like this at all. Huh. You made the right choice, man. It's like spam and then suddenly he'll get Merle would have got us all killed sooner or later. You gotta do that with the other ones though. <laughs> okay, now he's out of dialogue. Okay. Let's see if. Are we safe? There. Sophia does have something. I mean to be brave. Yeah, maybe a little bit. I'm worried about my mommy. Come. Will things ever be normal again? Will things ever be normal again? Will your grammar ever ever get good? 
I say as I stumble over my words, whatever. That doesn't have anything to do with grammar, so it's fine. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like, I'm the type of person who needs to exhaust all the dialogue. Um, you should see me playing Baldur's Gate 3. It's kind of tedious, but I love it. I love that game so much. It's my favorite game of all time, so. I'm getting really, really close to a thousand hours in the game, so. Woo. Hi, Dale. Dale. Nice what do you even you. do now that you don't have Andrea here with you? I never got a chance to tell you what I'm even doing here. <laughs> I'm here because of my wife, Irma. Was that a thing in the show or did they like, make that up? Because he doesn't have like a friendship with um, Andrea. It's not just walkers we need to worry about. Maybe that was a thing. What's the use of surviving this but losing our humanity? <laughs> so is this gonna be like, our humanity from the start to have no other character traits? Because Andrea's not here to make him a little more interesting. Okay. It's never wrong to try and talk sense into people. Yeah. Who are you gonna talk sense to in season one? No one? Because... Andrea's not here, so... It sucks, because that means we're not going to have this really nice moment where he's like... Well, okay, it's not really a nice moment, but it's it's a touching moment, anyway, where he... Uh, stays... He says he's going to stay and, like, and die with Andrea, if she's going to stay and die, you know? Although I don't really love some of it, because, you know, he takes the choice away from her. And like in a zombie apocalypse, that's like, you know. I feel like there's any time where it's like, okay. <laughs> to end things, it's like a zombie apocalypse, you know. I don't know. <clears throat> things got a little hairy in the city, didn't they? You're doing a great job, sawing. Where's Shane? Wasn't there like a conflict? Oh, I think it was over Glenn, and it was about okay, yeah, yeah. You want to know the best way to survive the end of the world? Uh, deliver pizzas. Seriously. Seriously. <sighs> heavy sight. I don't know what a heavy sight sounds like, but. Oh man. Oh man. I still can't believe this is happening. Saved your ass, didn't I? You sure did. I wish I didn't have to spam. Saved okay. your ass, didn't I? Yeah, sure. Hey, you think we'll be okay? Things are bad, but I'm glad you're here. I'm afraid, like, all the time. This is Dad, questionable. I. The voice I acting here. I never see you again. It's not horrible, but it's... I don't know. Dad, I... I thought I'd never see you again. Lori, hi. Sometimes I feel like there's nothing to hope for. It's nice to hear her voice. My family always comes first. We've got good people here. Shame hey, my... that you were dead. You know, somehow, some part of me always knew that you were alive. My, my favorite... Lori season is season one. I love her in season one. In season two, I still love her, but there's like a stretch of episodes where they write her extremely inconsistently. Like she she changes characters characterization every episode. In like there's like this stretch of episodes like somewhere in the middle where she does she constantly switches back and forth between different characters basically, which I I really don't like, but. And in season three, they just water her down so much that it pisses me off beyond no end. They, like they make her like uh, an entirely different character in order because people didn't like her, and it, it's, it's upsetting to watch. Um, it still has the optional get to know the. Oh. Okay. I guess they block this off because. And just not in there to talk to, so. And Amy's not in there to talk to either. Oh, that sucks, because. 
That too, like when the fucking when the camp gets attacked, like it's so tr fucking tragic. Like the Am Amy's death and Andrea's reaction, everything. Like that is such a big moment. Ugh. I'm just I, hmm, I don't like it. I don't like that she's not here. I guess I have talked to everyone. Where the fuck is Shane? I guess, oh, right, he hasn't come back yet. No, he's, oh, he's right there. <laughs> I didn't see him. Oh, yeah, he is back, obviously, because he was in, sorry, my brain is, like, all over the place. Rick, is that really you? Wow, can't believe my eyes. Well, you're not looking at me, so. Uh, back in high school, I used to think I was pretty hot shit. Well, I guess I still do. That's a random thing to say. At the beginning. LOL, so random. Awful. Worse than anything you ever seen. I'm trying to keep hope alive. Hmm. If you wait until the subtitle disappears, then but then you can spam. the world, man. That happens. Kind of sucks, don't it? Yeah, kinda. A little bit, I guess. Rick, you were. I thought. <sighs> it's a damn miracle, brother. His leg is like doing something weird. It doesn't look like it's attached to his body. Okay. Uh, there are people mission. out there exploring. Mm. You always need stuff. Expedition. Okay. There's only one right now. For Daryl Dixon, between a rock and a hard place. Uh, Daryl saw a few walkers roaming in the forest and wants to lead a group to clear them. He says a small group can clean up the area around the camp in no time. Uh, expedition success is determined by a decision. A decision. Oh my God. A decision made during the main mission. Hmm. Okay. Success gives you seven skill points. Failure gives you zero. Okay. Overrun. Go on an evening patrol to make sure the camp is safe. Wait, over so does that mean that they're gonna... Oh yeah, because when... Oh, this is Rick Grimes, okay. Go on an evening patrol to make sure the camp is safe. All right, hold on, we what? send some folks on a supply run. Yeah, because when the camp gets attacked and Amy gets killed and everything, everyone, and a bunch of other characters get killed, um, Daryl is gone. He left to go on this expedition. And then he's going to make sure that it can't be safe. Okay, but what are they going to do with the, this scene? Like, there's no other characters here. Is someone going to die anyway? And it's going to be, like, determinant who it is. Like, it's going to be, like, based on decisions or something. Yeah, let's play through this episode here. Then I'm going to start now. Uh, Laurie and Brick reunite following his miraculous return from the dead, leaving Shane crestfallen. As Rick adapts to his new life, he quickly emerges as a natural leader of the group, a role that Shane had previously assumed, but things can change quickly in this new reality. <sighs> Again, would have been nice to see Laurie and Rick like talk to each other, actually, and have a conversation. Uh, and it would be nice to see Shane's reaction, Shane being crestfallen, you know? And it would have been nice to see Rick adapt his new life and like, emerge as a natural leader. Like, it's not very natural when you tell me he's a natural leader and don't actually show me him being a natural leader. And then show, like, Shane being, like, <laughs> upset or envious, like, that Rick automatically falls into the role he had. And then the last line I just hate because it's like, this is a video game where you can change things. <laughs> It's different. It's a different reality from the video, from the TV show. Episode five, Overrun. A few nights later, survivors camp near Atlanta. Shit. Lori, Lori. The fucking pixels whenever the angle changes. Mm. 
Anything behind me. I gotta get back. Check the safety. Ah! What the fuck? Why would the sensitivity be that high? Are you kidding me? What's your problem? <laughs> Let's put it on one just to see if that's like much better. Because what the fuck was that? That's still a little bit too much. Okay. Suddenly I want. Um... Do I need to turn on the camera sensitivity a bit too? Does that help? Hold on. Oh yeah, the camera sensitivity is like ridiculous. Is it worse for some reason? What the hell? It's like, oh, I didn't notice it being like. I need oh. my gun. Light him up. I guess I'll get Rick, used to you. the sensitivity eventually. Or I'll check... Need your opinion. Oh, or I'll check... Um, oh, so these kind of decisions choose whether he succeeds on his expedition. Okay. Um, I'll check later if there's like... I don't know. I, I feel like there won't be any mods for this game. But I'm going to check if there are any mods that help with sensitivity or... Maybe just some tips for it. Um, okay. Expedition update between a rock and by sterile. Sheets... Shit's gone sideways. The stragglers led us to a big herd. Now we're pinned down by the quarry. Might need some backup. Stay burnt. Well, send help. I can't do voices. Hmm. Can we afford to send help? What do you mean us? Nobody's with you. Well, stay put with some help. Here's what I think. Stay low. Stay so. safe. We'll send a few folks to get you out of there. Whatever. Oh! Nice. There you go. Better conserve ammo. Well, I don't have... Forever. I don't have any animo, animo, ammo to conserve, so... <laughs> <laughs> Lock it low. Okay, how do you reload again? It's oh X. Nice ride. Can I? Okay. Uh, revolver damage. Oh yeah, yeah. Increase revolver damage. Great. Definitely. I've gotten so many achievements. I think I'm at like ten achievements or something already. Rick, help! Time to smash some skulls. I don't know if like, oh my god, oh it succeeded. So, okay. Here's what happened. Wait, with the extra help, we were able to di divide the herd and force them over the cliff. We also found an abandoned car with a bunch of supplies inside. Extra, who did I send? I thought I was going to, like, run over and, like, in the middle of all the chaos, tell someone to go help him. But I guess it's not bo bothering with, like, continuity. Yeah. Stay low. Stay safe. We'll send a few folks to get you out of there. I'm struggling with trying to do, like, a voice for Rick. I think with Daryl, even though it's not, like, good, I, I know a, what voice to do for him. With Rick, I'm just, like... <laughs> Ooh, make a good expedition decision. <laughs> That's a nice thing to say. Good expedition decision. I like that. It's fun. <laughs> but that gave me seven more. <clears throat> Plus 90 health? Ooh. Uh, yeah, let's let's do some more. It's gonna be great. For a wreck. And then a oh, no, few more. Can I like sneak around and do stuff? Oh, more ammo, more ammo. Lock and load. 
Probably shouldn't sneak. I should. Oh, I wanted to pick up the skill points. Oh, I gotta save her. Because I don't know how this game works. Like if people can get like killed. You're right up ahead. Rick, help! Get out of here! No, don't die, Lori. Don't die. I'm like, oh god. Okay. okay, okay. Help! I don't know if I'm gonna get the opportunity to pick up this stuff, but get off of me! How the fuck do you do the fucking? I don't remember how you do the execution. Sorry. Uh, triangle. Okay. Take that! Oh! Lori, Lori, Lori. No, 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 no. Lori! Are you okay? Get to the RV. Hang tight! I'm coming! Get off of me! No, 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 no! Oh my god, please, 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 please. Feeling a little better now. Ooh. Looks like I'm good. Go! Oh god, please, please, please. Please, 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 please. Feeling a little better now. Reload. Get out here. Me? Oh, I'm still here. I guess she died. Nothing. It was like very sudden. I need to just use the gun. Or I guess she's not in danger until she's being grabbed. Oh, damn. You kidding me? Maybe I can shoot better this time. Maybe I can do some stuff. I gotta get stuff. back. Check the safety. I hope that like expedition stuff is fixed. Like, it's a fixed decision. I so need that gun. It doesn't like change what happens or whatever. Because Shit. even if I make the same choice, you know what I mean. Rick, we need you. So I want those skill points. Right between the eyes. Easy. Here's what I think. If you say so. Right through the stuff. Eat shit. Better conserve ammo. It won't last forever. Uh, okay. Why did the buttons... Uh, the buttons are just inconsistent. Finders? Like, sometimes it's Xbox, sometimes it's PlayStation, sometimes it's keyboard. Like, damn. <laughs> like, the, the combat can be janky, but... Fix these things, please. Okay, it's fully reloaded. Rick, help! Um. Yay, That's okay. what down. Oh, I already. Oh. Damn, that's an interesting bug. I actually don't like that. Like, yeah, I got free points, but I don't like that. I don't like that I got free points. <laughs> but okay. Damn, this game is just like badly made. <laughs> okay. I thought it was just gonna be like clunky, but no, it's like badly made. <laughs> Great, okay. That's That's too bad. And it, it genuinely looks like they're never going to make another update again. They did one in December and then just never did again. No, that's not true. I hope they're working on something. I don't know, but... I'll, I'll check SteamDB and see if there's anything there, but probably not. This feels like the game they a game they put out and abandoned. Sucks. But what can you do? Let's do more stealth as well. I'm in handy. Lock and load. 
Can I skip this? Greg, over here. I guess not. They don't want to let you skip. Right. Uh, eh. Oh no, I want to do stomping. It's gonna be great. You're right up ahead. Oh, there's ammo. More ammo is always welcome. Right through the sky. Rick, help! Oh, an axe. Axe, 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 axe. Let's do this. Pressed a little bit too late, so it didn't. Not ready. Not ready. I'm exhausted. Hang tight. I'm not ready. My blood's boiling. Wait a second. Okay. Hang tight. Don't mind if I do. Uh, all right, it's L one. Oh, oh no. Bro, it's so sudden. Is there even like an indicator of her health on the UI anywhere? Because I don't think there even is. Like she just dies silently with no cutscene or indication that that's what happened. Like it looks like it bugs out. And why doesn't it say when you get after you see that she's in danger? And doesn't that make the most sense? I gotta get back. Check the safety. The reason I'm like walking around grabbing stuff instead of helping immediately is because I'm afraid that once I save her, it's over and I can. Okay, I can no longer grab Rick, everything. You. you know, because the way this game is like structured seems like that's how it would work. Yeah, I get to keep all my fucking. Ugh, Jesus, this that's this is really bad. Oh my god. This will come in handy. Like, Rick, come on. Help. Couldn't make sure, make sure at least that worked. It's very interesting. Um, getting all the upgrades, even though I shouldn't have this much yet. <laughs> Increase HP, sure. It's gonna be great. Didn't even check the other stuff I unlocked. Lock and load. That was able to, yeah. I guess I'm just farming right, XP here. right now. <laughs> More ammo is always welcome. Let's get this one because it's like a stealth, nah, easy stealth right. kill. Rick, help! Nah, it's been easy. Not ready. Don't mind if I do. Why do you keep crouching? Oh, oh, oh. Hang tight! Help! I'm saving you, please, 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 please. Get to the RV. Hang tight! I'm coming! Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. I'm still here! That's better. Feel like I'm. You're just standing here, Lori? Oh, my God. Reload, please. Finders, keepers. Okay, um, I need to pick some stuff up because. More ammo is always <laughs> welcome. Let's do this. Oh god, okay. Let me go! Lori, do you not fight? Like, come on. No energy. Oh my god, Lori. Right between please. the eyes. There we go. Like, you don't even. Come on. You can do something. Lori in the show was tougher than this. 
look like better medicine. Also, I can't believe you can only hold one item at a time. Like, at least let me hold two. Uh, Lock and load. Ammo. Rick, it's Carl. You have to find him. Oh, okay. Dad, help! I'm over here. Where? Stay put. I'm coming. Where are you? Oh, there you are. There's nobody here, buddy. Like you're fine. I'm just gonna go around and grab some stuff. Hello. Huh. Get stomped. Uh, ooh, Not a ready. shotgun. <laughs> Let me pick up the... That. Thank you. Okay. Um, okay, we got uh, crossbow damage. Yeah, crossbow damage, sure. This will come in handy. Blood's boiling. Nobody's getting close to Carl, right? No, nobody's getting close to Carl at all. Okay. Damn. Uh, oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> Get off of me! Eat shit. On my way! Oh, fuck! That happens so fast. Holy shit. Are you kidding me? Hang tight. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Here we go. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Get off of me. Let me go. Hang, hang tight. I'm coming. What the oh, hell? No, 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 no. Why is it like not working correctly? You know what I mean? There we go. That's what I was trying to do that entire time. My God. Weak attacks. Get away from me! Not ready. Get up! Oh, I'm still here! My blood's boiling. Damn. Get away from me! Oh, I'm still here! Ah, eat this! Feeling a little better now. Let me go! Oh my god, please get the fuck. Oh my god. There we go. On my way! Oh my god, oh my god. Uh, uh. There we go. Get off of me! I'm really worried oh, that somehow I'm gonna be able to like accidentally hurt Carl. You know what I mean? Oh, that's better. It's just... My instinct is gone. Oh my god, release from the love of God, get out of my fucking face. Oh my god, please. No, 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 no. <sighs> god, okay, yeah. This is frustrating. <sighs> Got a second wind. Get out of here! <sighs> it looked like he didn't have any like only had the whites of his eyes. Jesus Christ. <sighs> nice oh my god please for the love of everything please go away like the reason i'm moving like this is because i'm trying to get stuff too you know i don't want to just like oh. it okay. start. come on come on Okay. The engine's flooded. You got me some time. I'll get it started. 
All right. Oh my god. Taking a beating. Hurry. Nice, Vinny. Blood's boiling. Right between the eyes. What the? It'll be okay, baby. You just stay here. Right between the eyes. I'm okay. The army's taking a beating. Hurry. Let me go. They're gonna get in. Keep them away, Dad. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh God. Jesus, it's half health. Oh my, god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Keep them away! Almost got it, almost. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'm not done just yet. What the? Oh, they got started, okay. Right? Yeah. If only it was that easy, right? Get to the car. I love that the one walker just looked at him while he stabbed the one on the walker. <laughs> just a uh, shot, I mean. So I don't know what I'm talking about. Oh. Ah! Get up! I'm still here! Yeah, I can't. Literally can't. Even the strong attacks that are supposed to knock them back doesn't help. It's like it only affects the ones that you directly hit. Anyone who's behind them, not affected by them being knocked back. Don't take me to the start of it. Please, for the love of God, don't take me to the start of it. Please have better checkpoints. Please. Let me go. Um. Okay. I was getting that. Okay. Good. Like, look, that walker's just like, huh? Oh, that was good. Get to the car. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. Ah. Get out of here. I wanna, like. Oh, right, I have a shotgun. I, I thought, I forgot I don't have a, like a... What, you can't go through that? Are you kidding me? Thank God. Oh, finish Act One. All right. That was really bad. Like genuinely, worst part of the game so far, and does not make me excited because this is Act One. You know. Oh God. Okay. The next day, roadside. Can I pause? I guess I'll pause after the cutscene's over. Oh, it's another HQ thing. Okay. Roadside. Wait, is this... Are we in season two already? Hmm. Yeah, so we're skipping the entire, like, science base, whatever. I don't remember what it was thing. The, the part where uh, I was talking about Gail sitting down with Andrea. Well, she was going to uh, kill herself. Uh, I guess they're just skipping, because I think this is the start of Season 2 now. And the end of Season 1, I guess. <laughs> let's spend... Oh, 24. Let's spend our points, and then let's end the part. And I'm also going to stop playing for the day. And I'm going to look for mods, see if there's anything out there or not. Let's see. I might just as well just... Well, I can't upload him, upgrade him completely, but I can get one of these. Because, you know, Rick is the main character, right? So... Why not? Although Shane can take his role in this, I think. So I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure that was like one of the things they focused on the most in the promotional stuff.
So maybe I should get it for Shane? I don't know. Yeah, I'm not interested in this attacks. Uh, baseball bat damage increased by 30%. For, oh, Revolt Clip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. This will come in handy. That might help a lot. Uh, yeah, that was the end of Act 1 of um, The Walking to Destinies and um, the end of the second part of my playthrough. Yeah, it seems like my playthroughs are going to be around, like, my episodes are going to be around, like, an hour and a half. Because, again, it falls in that range, which I think that's good. That's good. It makes editing a m much less of a pain because editing an hour, an hour and a half, or even two hours is, like, nothing compared to editing seven hours, which I did multiple times for Alan Wick 2. Like, I think, like, three or four parts were in unedited form seven hours and that's not a bunch of stuff of me taking breaks because i pause my recording when i'm taking a break because in obs there's like a little pause thing next to the record stop recording thing and i'll just click that and it'll just instantly cut to my break eating or whatever being over so that was just me playing the game and talking and stuff so it was a lot more manageable uh, but oof, that section there really really revealed a lot of faults when it came to this, comes to this game because it's just it's just really badly designed um there's not really a way to deal there's not really a way to do crowd control not a reliable way anyway if that's key if the if what happened just now keeps happening consistently i'll lower the difficulty because it's not even that it's hard it's just so badly designed that it is based completely on luck whether you get out of a situation where you are being swarmed or not. It's complete, completely luck based on that front. Because there's, even though there are attacks that are meant to knock walkers back, you're either going to get grabbed constantly before you're able to do it, or it's just not going to work correctly. Like you're going to knock. You're going to be in the center of a bunch of them. You're going to knock back the ones that are directly in front of you, but the ones that are directly behind them are going to not move at all. And you can't run through them, you know, like push through them. Like, so there's not really a reliable way to get out of that. It's, it's not a good design. And then on top of that, there's no way to know um, if uh, someone's being grabbed there's no like clear indicator that someone's being grabbed other than seeing them and an easy indicator would be to have their health show up at the top of the screen when they're being grabbed slowly going down because there's no way to know how close death they are or how far away from death they are you don't know if am i able to just go a little bit to the right here and grab ammo or uh, skill points or do i have to directly run to them because you can't see their health you have no way of knowing it's not like the animation, like, well, at least I didn't see. The animation changes to indicate how close to death they are. And then on top of that, the skill points you use, at least in that section, stay used after when you die, like, and you reload. Like, they don't disappear. They just stay used. But you still get the skill points again <laughs> that you hadn't gotten yet. So you can just farm skill points and get all the skills immediately if you want to. Like at the first point where you can get skill points, just grab it, die, grab it, die, grab it, die, and eventually you'll have every single skill at the start of the game, which is a bit ridiculous. Uh, but, you know... I'm not hating the game. I, like, I, I, like I said, I am enjoying the combat when I'm not being swarmed by a ridiculous number of enemies because it's just... The enemy AI is horrible. And as we saw with Lori, she does not help. Like, your allies do not help you fight the walkers. They just... She just stood next to me and just got attacked a few times. You know, like, it's... Like... Lori is a full, fully grown adult, and Lori in the show is really, really tough. She would help. She would try to help. And there are plenty of weapons lying around. 
And I, I took the shotgun, that's my revolver. She can grab the revolver. Or if I haven't grabbed the shotgun, I still have a revolver. She can grab the shotgun and she can help me. Or she can just grab a knife or a baseball bat. Like there's plenty of weapons. It's it's silly that she doesn't, that she just stands there. Uh, but what was I saying? I was saying that um, other than, you know, those type of situations, I do enjoy the combat despite how clunky it is. And I am enjoying the voice acting and the little tiny bits of the story we get to see. <laughs> there are a lot of concepts that are really cool, like the conflict stuff is really cool. It would be cooler if it was voiced and it came up like a dialogue choice, like it, the, you know, like um, take responsibility, don't take responsibility, whatever. It would be cooler if it was an actual like, voiced scene, cutscene with choices that popped up instead of basically a fan fiction <laughs> same with the expedition calls and like those concepts are really cool but could be a lot better like i feel like this game is a good concept like i think if um this was a fan just a fan game it would i would be amazed by it you know I'd be like oh it's so cool it would be so cool if like all of these elements were taken and like made into like a complete game like that would be awesome you know and but th this isn't a fan game is the thing it's, it's it's an official like funded game official the walking dead game so it just it it sucks that it feels like just a concept and like i would love to see all of these things made into real maybe the fact that it's the walking dead is the reason it feels like a concept instead of a full game because Obviously, I'm, sh I'm like I'm sure using that IP cost a lot of money. That's probably where most of their budget went, as well as uh, like hiring back some of the actors. Like I'm thinking about it, and there was there were probably a lot more actors who would have been up for doing a Walking Dead game, but they could probably only afford a few of them, right? Because I don't know. I feel like there are several other actors here who probably would have loved to be in this game. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong, but. I think most of their budget went to uh, cast and um, the IP itself. And so everything else is so bare bones and it, like, it feels like I'm playing like the beta, you know? Is it beta, is that, or is it alpha where the game is like done, like, like not done, but you can like play the game all the way through. Is that alpha? It might be alpha. But it feels like I'm playing a really early version of the game and it's incomplete. Like, oh, like this part, the group conflict, that's going to be voiced. We just haven't done yet. We haven't written the lines and recorded them yet. So uh, this is just a proof of concept, whatever. And uh, same with the expedition talk, whatever. And uh, we actually want you to be able to have full on conversations with characters uh, like in the HQ, whatever. Like, you know what I mean? I feel like if this studio that made this game, if they don't go bankrupt i don't know which company made this if they don't go like bankrupt from like how horribly this game does after they spend all this money on the walking dead ip and uh, the cast um i feel like if they made a game that doesn't use an existing ip just a new game with these concepts entirely fleshed out it could make for a really good choice based game like a great one even you know like, I would love to see this expanded upon. Or maybe even, like, they could use an IP, but not something as big as The Walking Dead, you know? Like, what's a what's something they could use with, like, maybe isn't as expensive? I don't know price. I don't know how all that is, but just something else that isn't as big as The Walking Dead they can use. Because, obviously, the point is to change something that you've seen on TV, right? Like, you've seen how it officially went. Let's see what happens if we do it another way which i think is really cool it's actually something i've wanted to see for a really long time like funnily enough it's something i've been thinking about for years and years and years like pretty much for as long as i've been playing choice based games i've been thinking oh it would be co so cool if there was like a video game that took like a tv show i really love and let you make different decisions but also let you make the exact same decision to recreate that show like 
I've I always thought about Buffy the Vampire Slayer, like how cool it would be to like take control of the characters and like just make the same decisions if you want or change things completely. Like, I don't know. What's an example of one of those decisions? Um, like maybe you could choose whether, you know, at the end of season one of Buffy the Vampire Slayer, so spoiler for season one of Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Uh, you can just go watch it real quick. It's only 12 episodes. <laughs> um, but when Sandra goes to Angel to like work with him, begrudgingly work, work with him to help Buffy, if like in the game you would get the option, you were playing as Angel in that scene, you would get the option to completely reject the idea of working with him and go alone as Angel to the sewers or whatever to find Buffy. And if you do that, if you reject uh, working together with Sander, then Buffy dies and season two, Kendra is the like slayer, the official slayer in Sunnydale or something, you know? So, you know, stuff like that. I, I think that would be really interesting. I don't know. That's something I've thought about a lot in my life. And um, I was kind of like gobsmacked when I saw this announced and I'm, I'm sad that it's like this, you know? Like I said, I'm, I don't hate it. I just wish it was more fleshed out, more, more substantial, more detailed, more voice acted, more decisions. Like um, three hours into the game, and I've had one story decision. You know, it's it's a little you know for a choice based game. <laughs> It's a little unfortunate, uh, but I don't know if I was if I started some sentence there and didn't finish it because I kind of lost my train of thought because I went on a bit of a tangent. I think unless it wasn't a tangent, no clue because I talked too long. So, <laughs> but uh, those are some of my thoughts, I suppose. But I guess uh, when we continue. Uh, we're gonna have to resolve a conflict between uh, Lori and Shane. And then we're probably gonna have the walkers attack and Sophia running off. And I guess we'll see if it's possible to save Sophia. Which I hope, I hope it's possible. I feel like, I mean, that's such a big moment. If you're gonna do like a change reality thing, I feel like that's one of those things that you need to have be changeable. Because, like, in the comics, Sophia survives the entire thing. She survives the entire thing. She She's alive at the end of the comics. Which, which is awesome. Carol's not, though. Carol died, died, like, a long time ago in the comics. I don't remember. I haven't read the comics, but... Um... Oh, sorry, now I'm spoiling the comics. My bad. I'll put, like, a spoiler warning on the screen before I spoil it. <laughs> but I haven't read the comics. I've just... Uh... When I was, like obsessed with what the walking dead at one point i would look at the wiki a lot um specifically i was obsessed with telltale games walking dead but it's on the same wiki but i would look at the wiki a lot and i would look at the comic stuff and like and obviously i watched the show too at the time and i would like compare like the comics to the show and stuff and and i would just read about the characters what happened to them what, what was going on whatever uh yeah, I don't know if I was gonna say anything else. I'm, yeah, I just, I wanna end. <laughs> because uh, I'm just, I'm a bit frustrated from that sequence. Uh, and I hope next, next time I play, prob I'll probably record tomorrow. We'll see, we'll see how it goes. Um, I hope next time it, there won't be anything as frustrating as that. Uh, but anyway, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this part of the walking dead destinies if you did please consider giving it a thumbs up and uh, subscribing to my channel if you want to see more of my videos and yeah and oh and leave a comment i forgot that last part leave a comment if you have any thoughts questions or observations so see you in the next one bye